so this did not go the way i expected <laughs> oh my god i literally want to cry welcome back to my channel so in this video i have i have a rig review like i don't even know what this is all i know is that i wanted to show you guys my hair coloring skills you know i wanted to show you guys how i laid my wigs or whatever <laughs> silly me because honestly i don't even know why i do this to myself because i am not good with hair you all know that you guys already know that you know like i'm pretty good with makeup and um skincare or whatever i i got this unit on aliexpress the supplier is monster i'm gonna share with you what the package looked like when it came out of the box so i'm, I'm gonna show you guys what it looked like coming out right out of the package and the process of coloring that turned out to be a complete fail because this is not the color that i was looking for i wanted a brown color okay i wanted a brown color and you know i just went to the the, the drugstore and i got um the hair dye in the box which was probably my mistake but you know it's, this is not the first time that i've colored um hair before but this is the first time it turned out to be something completely different okay y'all so it came in this fedex package i think it took three days to get to me very impressive um usually i send my items to my skybox but you know i contacted the seller and i asked the seller to send it directly to trinidad and i'm so glad i did because not only did it save me money it came here faster than i anticipated so i'm gonna open up the package to see what the wig looks like and i'll be right back by the way the seller of this unit is monster as you guys can see I will leave a link in the description below guys so don't worry all right so let's remove the wig from the packaging and see let's see what we're working with okay so far so good i received um a wig cap um yeah i got a two i got a two-piece wig cap and i love that i love that they give you the caps so as you guys can see it is definitely a body wave um, I don't like to get straight wigs because I do straighten my hair when I want it to be straightened. But I also love, um, uh, I like getting the, the the body waves so that, because the body waves tend to hold a curl better than a straight, than straight hair, basically. Okay, guys. So this is what the hair looks like under the package. It's very soft. Um, you can see the waves are, patterns are very nice. Um, this is supposed to be 180 density, but y'all, I don't know. It doesn't feel like it. It doesn't, it feels like 150. But yeah, this is the hair. It's soft. It feels soft. Um, it looks good. The hair is nice and shiny. And um, I am going to try this wig on and then I'm going to color this hair. And I'll get back to you guys soon okay as you can see it does look like a 22 inch is very stringy at the end so I'll definitely have to cut um, after I'm done coloring but you know this is this is it I can run my fingers through it it's not very it's not tangly don't see any shedding but you know this is a new wig you're not gonna know what the wig is gonna do until after that first wash okay but anyways um this is the hair guys haven't trimmed the lace yet haven't trimmed the lace yet it's pretty good pretty neat right so um yeah i'm actually feeling this blonde but you know it's just too yellow i can't wait to color this so that and show you guys the final results okay so this is me coloring the hair now honestly i do not know if I was thinking maybe I should have wet the hair first. I applied the color to the dry hair. As you, you all can see, I only had three bucks of dye, but I was able to color all the hair um, eventually. Uh, when you look at the color hair while it's been applied, it has like a very rich, um, dark 
chocolate brown looking color so you know i thought that you know at least um i thought that i would have gotten that color that you see here on the box um, clearly this is not what happened i felt like i left the color on long enough i i'm sure i left it on for a little over 20 minutes or more most definitely i left it on for a while so yeah and y'all wait for it just wait for it is what it was at this moment i realized that i really fucked up because this is what it looked like after i rinsed shampooed and conditioned now this is supposed to be brown i don't know if you guys can see this on camera but it is gray af it is gray. like i literally look like an old lady and when i wear this without makeup i look like a witch okay it is gray it is so gray i don't know if, i don't know if you guys can see that but it is so gray all right so yeah i'm gonna talk to you guys about you know what happened with the color and process but before i do that let me just go into the specs of the the wig and we're gonna get into that later <laughs> anyways so recently i felt like i wasn't feeling the black hair anymore i wasn't feeling the bangs anymore i don't want to go back to blonde but you know i wanted to go back to brunette like you know a brown color all right now this is the color that i wanted that's the color y'all i don't know if i'm tripping but this is not the color that i got and i thought that you know because since i'm you know coloring the hair straight from blonde that it would take the color really well so i don't know if it's if it's um the hair the quality of the hair or if it's the dye if you all have any tips please leave some of those tips below in the comments because your girl need help all right anyways so i ordered the 22 inch and i got a lace front wig all right so you can you can part this here like you can do like an off center part a side part a middle part you can do a deep side part because i'll show you guys like if you do a deep a deep side part this is what you're gonna see you're gonna see like a lot of tracks all right so you can do like a middle part and the part goes um you know pretty long you can do a middle part and an off the center side part side part you can do that okay so i wanted to do a side part because i never wear a side part like i never wear a side part i always not a side part a middle part my god y'all what am i doing okay i never <laughs> i never ever wear a, a middle part i usually go for um the side part off the side off center you all know what i mean okay i wanted to try something different and i wanted to have like a nice little brunette color um, I like the color that you see on the box. I didn't want to go black because I feel like, you know, I've been wearing black hair for a long time and I always felt like black hair was a little bit harsh on me because my natural hair color is not even black. It's like, it's brown, <laughs> you know? So anyway, I got a 22 inch, I got 180 density and I got a body wave, all right? So um, why did I get a body wave even though I wear my hair straight all the time? I felt I feel like you know when I get a body wave instead of you know like a full straight hair I find like it holds a curl a lot better than straight hair that's why I, that's what I love about body waves even though I don't really like the body wave texture like I would prefer my hair to be like straight all the time but straight hair most straight hair doesn't really hold a curl very well so you know I always go to the body wave and I just blow dry and flat iron the hair and wear it straight and when I want to, when I want to get some curls, I you know I just I just you know curl it, and go about my day. Anyways, so when I came, okay, so the hair is pretty good. Um, it doesn't tangle even after it took the color and everything like that. It doesn't tangle at all. It it's not shedding. So so far it doesn't shed because I've already washed this hair, colored this hair. Because usually you don't really know what the hair is gonna be like until after that first wash or color. Or maybe bleach or whatever so I got the hair at 613 that's the color that I got and I usually prefer to do to get a 613 when I want to color the hair because I don't I don't want to have to bleach here all right I don't want to bleach it it's too much work and on a lot on a lot of times you see that I don't like that brassy orangey color I hate that color that color is so gross and it just oh, I don't like it I still got a tan you also my makeup doesn't match my chest deal with it all right anyways so 
so i got a body wave i got a 22 inches i got uh, um 180 density and i got a uh, you know typical lace front because most of my wigs are lace front um i've never really had luck with full lace wigs because they tend to shed a lot for whatever reason okay the last time i i, I got a full lace wig it was a disaster i was so disappointed even though i love the wig i love the hair and everything like that but you know for now i just stick with the lace brand if you know a supplier that sells like really really good full lace wigs that don't shed let me know or if you're in trinidad and you know someone that does that makes really good custom wigs please hit me up hit me up on instagram like, i hope you guys are following me on instagram like seriously follow me on instagram okay and send me a dm if you know anything hook it hook a sister up okay because i need help so um, i'm not at all disappointed with the quality of the hair i love the quality of the hair um it doesn't feel like 180 density in my opinion but you know you guys can decide for yourself if it is okay you let me know let me know what you think but it doesn't feel like 180 density it feels like more like 150 but i i don't know like i was expecting it to be um a little a little more dense but i could be wrong again it's me you're talking about okay it's me hey it's me i don't know shit about hair so the wig came very quickly like it came in about four days to my country it came in four days not bad right three to four days i can't remember it came pretty quickly all so i'm pr i was pretty happy about that um i think i paid like 150 dollars for this unit the price is not the issue you know because i would have paid more but you know i bought this because the reviews were pretty good and i wanted 613 body weight etc so all in all i would give this unit and how, how, how would i rate this unit i'm gonna rate this a 7 out of 10 it's good it's pretty good it's not amazing but it's pretty good the quality is good i feel like the hair is so soft the hair is not dry it doesn't maybe it looks dry because i'm on camera and or whatever but it doesn't feel dry it's actually very soft i blow dried it i flat ironed it i colored this and everything and it still feels very soft it doesn't tangle it doesn't shed the cap size is a pretty good size the other wig that i have which i don't recommend okay the one that you all know the one that i've been wearing for a long time with the bangs i love that so much like i wore that all the time anyways um that one um the cap is so small it can barely fit my head that's why when a lot of people came in my dms and they asked me about it i just didn't recommend it and i don't i don't remember doing a review on that one to be honest because you know i don't like the hair is pretty good but the wig cap is so small and i don't even have a big head my, i think my head is pretty small or average i don't know so um the hair itself i'll give it a 7 out of 10 so let's talk about the color <laughs> this is not a color that i wanted i do not know what it's looking like on camera right now but in person it looks pretty pretty bad it looks so gray i don't like it at all it doesn't look good on me um i feel like you know in order for this to look good on me all the time i'll have to wear um a, a ton of makeup and use filters or whatever all right and you know i just don't think it goes well with my complexion so what i'm gonna do i'll probably well not probably most likely most definitely i'm gonna go back to the store and get um another color and i'm gonna try color it maybe put in another layer of color on this i might do the same color because i really really like this color y'all this is the color i really like this color i mean am i tripping y'all because maybe i should i go a little darker what do you all think y'all tell me because when i put it here against the the box it looks like it but why does it look gray on me like i don't understand it looks gray in person you all i am so confused so i'll definitely go back and put another layer of color on this here to make it a little bit darker um i feel like you know what i'll probably use an, a different color and not the same one so um again uh when i while i was coloring the hair everything was going great um while the while the dye was on the hair itself it looked like a really nice chocolate brown but when i start when i rinsed the, the the dye out and i started shampooing um the the color well obviously the dye was rinsing out and then of course the color just started looking more and more gray 
it was like it looked very ash brown or ash blonde like a dark ash blonde that's what it looks like in person so um i'm thinking that maybe the color wasn't strong enough or maybe i didn't leave it on the hair long enough you if you if you guys have any tips please let me know in the in the comments because i have no idea i don't know i don't know what the fuck i'm doing like i literally do not know what i'm doing i this is a fail but again i'm not gonna give up on it because the hair is pretty good it's pretty good um the supplier is the name of the supplier on aliexpress is monster i'm gonna put a link below in the description if you are like, interested i will put a link because you know i got you girl i got you um if you if you want it again i'll give it a seven out of ten um and why i didn't give it a full um a full 10 out of 10 obviously i'll, I'll tell you why um i don't feel like it took the color well it's up to you to decide there were other people that colored the hair and they were very successful so maybe it's not the hair itself maybe it's me it retained its softness and you know manageability even after my first wash and color which is which is good um i don't see any shedding because sometimes after you wash a wig you see a lot of shedding i don't see any of that and um honestly um it's a pretty good unit it's just that it's not the best unit that you can ever find you know you can't do a deep side part obviously it's a lace front um i feel like i'm talking too much so i think what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna end this video right now because i feel like i pretty much covered everything that most people would be you know um curious or concerned about so yeah that's all for this video um if you tell me let me know what you guys think about this color below does it look good is it a disaster like i think it is should i color it again let me know in the comments and i'll talk to you soon bye